Hey, how's it going, guys? And welcome back to yet another episode of our Pokemon Black Randomizer Nuzlocke. And today, we are here. We did just defeat the Castile City Gym in the last episode, and now we're here. I've done a little bit of grinding. Some mons, you know, level up a lot quicker than some other mons, uh, which I have come to notice. Um, I don't know. It's, uh, we'll do a bit of a, a team recap because we do need it. Um, and we'll have a look at what levels and what is going on. So this boy here levels up far too quickly and a lot quicker than most of me other mons. And of course we did catch him on in the last episode so this boy here did end up being the one that helped, you know, train up the doobie. So, Evian the Pidgeot, level 32, um, with Tangled Feet, holding the amulet coin because he... He's a greedy fella, clearly. And we got Tackle Twister, Gust, and Wing Attack. Uh, sorry, I wish I had Wing Attack. Quick Attack. Next up, we got Saint V Carrot Blast, level 28 with Swarm. And we got Peck, uh, Fury Attack, Headbutt, and Bug Buzz, which you did learn by level up. This thing should evolve. Um, I don't know what level. It could be 40 for all I know, which is not good. Having a Carablast on the team to level 4, it doesn't sound like a very good idea, but hey -oh, we'll see how far we can get with this little boy. Next we've got Quentin, level 28, who is a Beedrill with Swarm also. And we got Fury Attack, Struggle Bug, uh, Twin Needle, and Toxic Spikes. Next up we've got Tongues, the Weeping Bell, level 28. Uh, we've got Chlorophyll as its ability, and we did learn knockoff in between episodes, and we've also got Vine Whip, Acid, and Sleeping Powder. Um, we can go back and get the Leaf Stone in Castelia, which I might actually go and do. We might go and do that before we start today's episode. And then, our new boy, which is Gris, the Therathon, level 29. Did take quite a lot of training in this, it was quite difficult. Um, with Iron Barb's ability. We've got Pin Missile, Rollout, Gyro Ball, and Metal Claw. Cool story, Bob. But that's the team currently. Um, we'll put... Let's put Tongues out from Tongues. Uh, let's go and get this Leaf Stone, first of all. I'd forgot about the Leaf Stone, otherwise I'd have started at the Pokemon Center, but that is fine. The Power of Speed Up will help us get there a little bit quicker. So let's go and get the Leaf Stone. Unless I actually got it. I can't remember if I did. I think I said we'll come back and get it if we need it. Um, how is it you? Uh, Pan Sage. There we go. So that will help us. I'm glad to give you the option. Which is nice. So we've got ourselves a Leaf Stone now. So when we want to evolve Weeping Bell into Victory Bell, that is something we can do. Not going to do it just yet because I don't know um, if it learns anything, if it stops learning moves when it levels up. I'll have to check its moveset in between episodes and we can make that decision next episode. But for now, it does look like we've got a trainer battle coming up against Sharon. Uh, which I'm not too thrilled. We still do have a massive weakness to fire and flying on the team. Fire in particular. So, let's hope we don't have anything of that sort. Hey Brandy, I've been waiting for you to get the insect badge. And now it's time to see which one of us is the stronger trainer. Cool. Now, I'm not particularly thrilled about fighting you. With four Pokemon. Okay. Azubot's not too bad, actually. Hmm. Zubat's not too bad. We're now level 20. So, that's not too bad. We should be able to... Uh, mm. Okay, that does more damage than I want it to, so I am going to get the heckles out of here. Um, so, let us do that. Evian, it looks like it's for you. I could have gone out into Gris as well, but I think this is probably the better idea. So, let us... Gust. 
don't go as you. We are. I do want to avoid using Evian as much as I can. Clang. Ooh, an electric type, steel type. Can't really do anything to this boy, can we? It is level 20. So that's scary because that's going to do more damage. We are 12 levels because of this guy just over levels so easily. What actually does damage? Oh, that is going to do a decent amount. Um, let's go into Gris, actually. I feel like Gris might be able to deal with this, question mark. I there's a fire type, I don't have anything else to stand against um, it other than Evian. Um, Gyrobog is off speed. This into a parrot. We've got really low speed, so let's see how much Gyroball actually does. That's actually good because he's going to deal damage to himself. Twice. Nice. If we got a Rocky Helm, it's definitely going on you. Gyroball's enough because it's based on speed. Nice. Uh, Corfish! Go! Corfish! Corfish, go! Okay, so I guess we can deal with this Corfish very easily. Corfish! It lived on warm. Wow. Okay. Oh uh, no. The sandstorm's gonna take you out. That's fine with me. And it's Carnivine, of course. Let's go. I really want to use Saint, but I'm not grinding him up and then him dying. So we're not gonna use him. It'll probably as soon as he evolves into Escavalier, it's literally gonna be. Like, it's probably gonna die in its first match. Hey, poison. Nice, nice. One thing we do have type coverage for cross types. We have a lot of bug types. A lot, a lot of bug types. So, this turn should be enough. We'll struggle bug, why not? And down goes the carnivine. Nice! I thought you'd be a lot higher level than he was. It's clear to me now, the reason you are so trapped is because you trust between you and your Pokemon. And that shouldn't be a problem. Now I can get most out of my other Pokemon. Because you don't have a Servine. Hello there! Hey Brandy, do you have a second? Professor Juniper. Uh, Professor Juniper. Do you need something? I call Bianca too, but I guess she didn't have a call. I wonder what she's caught up in. Well, I suppose I'll just have to call her later. I'm going to wait for you two in front of the gate of Nimbasa City. Nimbasa's gate is straight down Route 4. So it is. Well, I'm actually going, we're going to go back and heal because, you know, I'm not dealing with all of this schniz. I'm not dealing with losing Mons and Paralysis. And just get rid of it. And then we can head onwards to the next area. Um, I think there's two mons we can get between here and Nimbasa. There's the the Relic Castle. I think Relic Castle is its own encounter. And then there's uh, the mon on the outside in the desert. I don't know what the actual desert's called. But there is an outside desert area as well. So let's go and get those two encounters here today. Um, I'm hoping we can dodge a lot of the trainers here. Um, a cell battery. Cool. Um, I just don't want to fight them right now. I can use them all. A choice scar. Wow. Increases speed for locking you into one move. That's not bad. That isn't bad at all. A choice scar could be very useful actually for this team. Um, I am going to avoid battling these guys. And of course, I wait and there's a Miss Magius. This thing gives hella XP, by the way. This thing does give hella XP. Or it did when I was fighting, anyway. Could we not do this? Thank you. So that is the way that we're supposed to go. I was going to say, I think you're a trainer, aren't you? 
We could take on one or two if we, well, if we get caught by them. I don't intend to take on any trainers, but... Oh well. Snow, run, run, run. Snow Runk's cool and all. Uh, I don't like seeing a Snow Runk here against a grass type. But, hopefully that doesn't matter. Does not matter. Good stuff. Artist Jonathan. Now, I know, is there an item? I can't remember if it's in this game or if it's in the second game. Electro Ball. So it's normally dig, but we've got Electro Ball TM. Nice. Um, can anyone learn it? Two ones can learn it. Okay. We've not really got many decent TMs, have we? I have noticed that. So we're going to go under the bridge. Wow. So, Desert Resort. So this is a new encounter here. So, Desert Resort encounter is going to be a... A Kavana. Now, it's not too bad. It is another male. Um, it's not too bad. Purely because it's a water type. And we could really do with a different typing. Something that isn't weak to fire. So, I will take it. Um, we should be able to Pokeball this thing. Let's have a see. Let's have a see. Are we going to be able to catch this thing? We are indeed. So I'm not going to add it to the layout just yet. I'm going to see what we get in our next encounter. And then I will add the new, well, whichever of the new encounters I think is best. Though Kavana is a very good pick up. Um, I'm going to be, am I going to be generic and just call you Jaws? Or should I call you Schnapper? Schnapper. Or should I actually call you Schnapper? Schnapper. Schnapper. Schnapper it is. So let's have a look at you. You've got a covered fossil. That's a fossil we can revive. Ice Fang. Increase attack, lowered defense. Wow. That's insanity. Schnapper over here is uh, quite interesting. So we got an actual fossil, held item fossil, which is interesting. Nice. And I think we get the fossil here, Desert Resort. So this is a Desert Resort as well. I'm going to defeat this trainer because he is a healer. And I know um, healers... Uh, this would be helpful if I do grinding. This is where I should have come through grinding, if I'm being completely honest. But we haven't come this far, so... There was no way. So, he's going to heal up my mom, make them very healthy in this harsh environment. Now, I know there's a lot of items and trainers. I am particularly going to avoid them. So glad I didn't come in here and get my encounter, because a collector would have not been... So I think it's near the middle. Executor. Ooh, that would have been pretty cool. Um, I already have a grass type, so I'm not too broke up about not getting that. It's an item. Quick powder. I think there's a lot of items around here. I just don't particularly want to go hunt for them all right now. Um, I just mainly want to see what our encounters are here. Where is the castle. I think it might be further back, potentially. Oddish. We've got all the mons from Gen 1 who are grass type here. Yeah, it's further back, isn't it? Goddish. It's the Goddish! The Goddish. Alright, we've got to be further back then, aren't we? 
I don't actually know whereabouts this thing is. I feel like I've gone past it. I really do. Lampent would have been really cool. Because it's a ghost fire type. A water stone? Okay. I'll take a water stone, actually. Sun flora. Flora, flora. Yeah. Not interested. I don't actually know where this place is. Or have I not gone far enough back? Is that my problem? I didn't go far enough back. It appears to be a Pokemon. A statue of a Pokemon. So, Relic Castle. This is another encounter as well. Um, I think I can dodge these trainers. Here we go. Relic Castle encounter is... An LGM. Ooh. I never knew LGM had gender. LGM, eh? Mmm. That's a spicy, spicy encounter. Now, there's a chance... Saint might have to sit out. I might have to add both of them. I don't mind keeping Saint as a backup for if any of the Pokemons do decide to dip off the team for whatever reason. Um, that's really interesting. When we get to the Pokemon Center, I'll take a look at everything and then we'll decide. Um, but what should we call you? I really feel like just calling you E.T. Because you do remind me of E.T., the extraterrestrial. Now, I know if I go around here, if I talk to this person, we've been carrying two fossils. we got a cover fossil, so let's grab ourselves the plume fossil, because I think the fossils are actually the same. So, let's do that. So, if I dodge and weave, like that, we can get ourselves out of here. Now, I want to see... I'm trying to avoid the dark patches so I don't run into encounters. Taylor! Taylor! Taylor would be cool. We've already got a flying type, so we didn't exactly need one. There isn't a Pokeball here, actually. Tauros. Not exactly the best ones in this area, it looks like. Looks like we might have got one of the better options. Looks like it, anyway. A Pokeball. Replaces one that we just used. Um, let's heal up real quick. And then we can head back to. Well, where are we going? To uh, Nimbasa. So that's what we'll do. Muna. I'm glad we didn't get two psychic types. That's what I'm happy about. Um, but it does mean we might end up adding both to this team. But we'll have a look at that once we get to Nimbasa, because we're not quite there yet. Alright, we've got Battle of Dew, so I don't know why I was waiting. Um, north of here, I think there's a, yeah, there's a dude here. Which we can avoid swiftly and surely. And here is the Professor. Hello there, Brandy. Come here. Okay. The card and was asking me all about electric type Pokemon, so I thought about you guys. I want you to here are freebies for you. Here, Sharon, and you too, Brandy. Ultra. Hmm. Ultra Ball, as you say. Interesting. I want you to join you. Be sure a good type of Pokeball, because it could be the first and last time you see that Pokemon. I know it might seem strange for me to ask, since I'm the one who asked you to complete the Pokedex, but. Remember to enjoy your journey. Of course, I'm not saying you can neglect the Pokedex, but I, you know that. Yeah, I kind of already am neglecting it because I can only catch one Pokemon every route, but hey. It seems the professor gave us Pokedex as a reason to send us on a journey. At least that's what my mom told me. I want you just to go out and see the world, so my mom, Bianca's mom and your mom, made a request to Professor Juniper. What should we do now? I think we're... I'd like to show my uh, show the professor my thanks by going to Route 4 and catching some more Pokemon I haven't caught. You do that. Meanwhile, we're going to head in to Nimbasa City. Oh, joys. I forgot about these guys. Perhaps we know you run a daycare. 
How do we know? Because we're Team Plasma. The other one taking people from Pokemon. Since you're a worker of daycare, we figure you must have lots of Pokemon. Hand him over. What kind of nonsense is this? Uh, you there. A strong looking trainer, help me. If you're looking to get to, uh, get in our way, we'll take your Pokemon too. Yeah, right, whatever. I'd love to see you try. Do, do, Dan Spots is very sparse. He's coming your way. Let's have a see. Uh, I can't remember if you're physically defensive or special. I think you're just defense. Oh, you're definitely physically defensive. Physically defensive. Glare into my eyes. Interesting. Yeah, it's physical defensive. That is fine. I'm glad I clicked acid. There we go. Do, 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 do. A poignard. Ooh. Poignard is dark steel. So let's go to Quentin. Let's go to Quentin and pull a pin missile. Not pin missile, we did learn pin missile. Um, we already tried to learn pin missile. Let's use Twin Needle and see. It's enough. Is most certainly enough. Ugh. This went out fast. I think we better run. Let's hide in the amusement park. Bye. Oh, thank you so much. You take this took away a brand new bicycle. Cool. So he gives us the bicycle. I want to ride your bicycle. I have a day car on Route 3. If you have any Pokemon you want me to raise, stop me off. Brandy, you know? The professor told me about Nimbasa City has lots of things to do. Uh, the museum park, the big stadium, the small court, and the battle subway. I'm going to the musical. See you later. Bye. Okay. <laughs> well, she's going to the musical anyway. Do 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 Right, let's have a say. I think I'm gonna do what I decided in uh well what I decided earlier on. I think I am going to no we're not in the death box. I think I'm gonna pick up the uh LGM. Psychic typing's good for us. Um and it doesn't hurt Saint being put back in the box. Saint um should evolve at level 40. Unless it's 30, I don't know, I could be, could be wrong, it could be level 30 to be all I know. Um, but, if anything happens to one of the mons we've currently got on the team, I don't think it'll be a bad shout if anything happens. Um, so we'll try and get LGM and Schnapper leveled up, try and catch them up, at least 28 I'd say. And um, we'll be able to take a look at Nimbasa City in the next episode but that is going to be for me today hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did make sure you hit that like button down below because i do very much appreciate all your guys support but for now have a wonderful and safe day and i'll catch you guys in my next episode of the pokemon black randomizer nuzlocke see you guys all then bye for now